Environmental Protection Agency was grilled on Capitol Hill today. Scott Pruitt fielded tough questions for almost four hours about his spending, travel, and lodging practices. CBS 4's Kenneth Craig has more from Capitol Hill. Facts are facts and fiction is fiction. House Democrats aggressively questioned Scott Pruitt's spending practices like as head of the EPA Thursday, particularly the $43,000 spent on a soundproof booth installed in his office. You're saying that staff did it without your knowledge? I was not involved saying. in the approval of the $43,000, and if I'd known about it, Congressman, I would have refused it. The former Oklahoma attorney general was scolded by lawmakers for renting a D.C. condo from an energy lobbyist for just $50 a night. I wonder what the owners got or tried to get in return for their generosity. This is another example of pay to play. Under pressure, he admitted to authorizing his chief of staff to sign off on hefty raises for two top staffers. Yes or no, did you authorize him? There are delegations giving him that authority. Lawmakers on both sides of the aisle have called for Pruitt to step down, but some House Republicans at the hearing came to his defense. I think it's shameful today that, that this hearing has turned into a personal attack. I think this has been a lot of a classic display of, of uh, innuendo and McCarthyism. Pruitt himself characterized the hearing as an attempt to derail President Trump's agenda. I'm simply not going to let that happen. The president has expressed confidence in Pruitt. The White House says a review of his ethics issues is ongoing. Kenneth Craig, CBS News, Capitol Hill. Pruitt is expected to be grilled by another House panel. Both hearings were scheduled to discuss the EPA's budget.